race fans, we are here for the fourth feature event of the night here on July 23rd, 2016. It is the Mod Minis. Seven Mod Minis are set to roll off for 25 laps of action. And as they are lined up right now, it's going to be Mark Brote on the pole position in the sixth. And starting outside of him in the 17, that is Brad Blanton. Row two on the inside in the 35, that is Bobby Dooley. And to his outside in the 71, that is Ted Volpius. And the third row, we have six Mod Minis on the track, actually. That's going to be David Russell in the 31 and Ed Michalak in the 76. Uh, it appears that the 21 of Jeff Newton, who is who was slated to roll off third, in this race uh, will not make the start. So we'll have one car not being able to start this race. Right now it's the one to go signal. They're doubling them up. Six mod minis, 25 laps. This could be good. And this will be good. Now one thing I want to point out is that 76 car, that is the fastest gremlin I have seen. I was watching that car in practice earlier. And I just think it's cool. That's a gremlin. I mean, you don't see that many AMC cars as a, in general rolling around. So that is pretty cool. However, the two drivers to watch in this race, definitely the 71 of Ted Vulpius and the 31 of David Russell. The pace car is going to come pulling off of the track. Here we are at a turn four. Green flags in the air, and the Mod Minis are racing. Brad Blanton is going to get the lead going through one and two. Uh, Brote's going to stay in second. Here comes Volpius trying to come to the outside to get by Brote. Volpius is going to get by him on the outside in three. And David Russell is going to try and follow him. So Blanton's going to lead lap one. And here comes Russell now to the outside of Brote to try and get the third spot away. As they come off of two down the back straightaway. Um, side by side they go. Russell's going to be poking out a little bit. And he's going to get by Broke. But Broke's going to stay close to him on the inside. So Broke is still going to try and do this once again at six. With Bobby Dooley right there in the 35. Running back in the fifth spot. Now... Up front, it's Brad Blanton in the 17 with Ted Volpe is still in that second spot. Volpius and Blanton won a lot of races in this division here last year. And we'll see who wins tonight because this is only the fourth race of the year that this division has run. And in the three other races prior, each one had a different winner. First night of the year that these guys ran. Robbie Yoko won the race race in his only start of the year. And that was followed by Ted Vopius, who won on May the 14th. The last race these guys ran out, Vopius had some problems, Blanton wrecked out, and David Russell in the 31 car won. The points battle for this division is actually pretty tight. Ted Vopius leads the points. David Russell is two points behind him in second, and nine points behind him in third. It's Bobby Dooley. So... That's three drivers who are mathematically possible to win this title. Uh, Bobby Dooley in the 35 is trying to work on Mark Brote in the 6. And up front, Volpius is trying to track down Blanton. Bobby Dooley's trying to close in on that six car. He's going to go to the inside. Not going to work. And he's going to stay on the inside as they come off of four. Battle for the spot. Here they come up to the 76 now. Michelak, they're going to get around him. They're on the inside. Got caught up behind him. Now they're going to have to go by him on the outside. But it looks like Volpius is in striking distance to try and get the lead from Blanton. We'll see what happens. Uh, Brad Blaine still has the lead. Will he become the fourth different winner in the fourth race of the year? We'll have to find out. 
because I think he can win this. He can win this. They're still pretty close. Wet and Volpe, they're still pretty close. Seventeen to seventy-one. Back to three and four. Still pretty close by the two of them. So we'll see if Volpe's can become the first of 2016. over the back bumper of, of, of Blanton. He's going to try and close in on Brad Blanton now as they go into three. And he's still pretty close to that 17 car. And he's going to look no. And we're halfway as Ted Volpius is now going to go to the inside of Brad Blanton. And Volpius is no. Blanton is still pretty close. Yes. Off of two. New leader, Ted Volpius. Mr. Mod Mini himself. As that 71 car now has a, a familiar position for him and a familiar place to see the number 71. Bobby Hooley is still trying to get around the six of road for the fourth spot. He's working on it bit by bit. of the six, not going to happen. He's still trying to get around. And yes, he does. Bobby Dooley goes to the inside, and he takes four for Mark Broat. And Mark Broat is slowing on the racetrack. Something is wrong with the six car. But your leaders have checked out. Bumpy is in Blanton. It's just going to be smooth sailing ahead for the two of them from now until the end of the race. laps remaining right now as Bobby Dooley is trying to close the gap on David Russell for third. Closing stages of the race, Dooley is getting pretty close up to David Russell right now as they come off of two. There could be a potential battle for the third spot here in the closing stages of the race between the 31 and the 35. And Bobby Dooley is going to go to the inside off of four. Trying to get third away from David Russell. Dooley's best finish of the year is a second, and he plays second. And oh, Brad Blanton and Ed Michalek get tangled up in four. The 17 of Brad Blanton gets tangled up with that AMC Gremlin. Yellow flag is out.
just when you thought this race was going to be caution free, this happens. And that means that every single, uh, all the features that have been run tonight have had at least one caution flag period. How about that? Ted Volpius is still the leader. He's just got to catch up now to the front. Okay, here comes Ted Volpius now in the 71. Here he comes. Ted Volpius and Brad Blanton dominated this division last year when it was still known as the Mini Stocks. And... Volpius cruised his way to the championship. He's going to choose the outside line for the restart. Is he? No. So, as they run now, it's Volpius, Blanton, Russell, and Dooley. Ball to the back, moving David Russell up into second. And Blanton is going to fall back into third. Flagman giving them the one to go signal. We will be green next time by to finish this race. Ted Volpius has chosen the outside line to restart off, but David Russell's on the inside of the 31. In the point standings, those two drivers are separated by only two points. So this race tonight could determine who takes over the points lead. Another driver to watch for is that driver in the third spot, Bobby Dooley. He's nine points behind Volpius in the standings, and after coming in second, he's just itching to get his first win. He was winless here last year, and up to this point this year, he has been winless. So to see a new face in victory lane tonight would actually be pretty nice. And I'm also not going to count out that 17 of Brad Bland. In fact, I think those four drivers, any of those four, can win this race. Green flags out. We're back racing. Volpe's is going to get a really good start. And Brad Blanton is going to try and battle for second with the 31. It sounded like the 30, 35 might have missed a gear on that start. I don't, maybe slip the tires? But uh, Ted Volpe is out front in the 71. And the next time by three laps to go. Next time by, it's going to be two laps to go. And Brad Blanton is getting pretty close up there with that 31 car. We could have another a battle for second going on. All right, coming out of turn number four, two laps to go. Brad Blanton is going to go to the inside of David Russell. And he's still going to be in the third spot. Blanton is going to try and go to the inside of Russell again. He's going to bump Russell. Brad Blanton is also going to be competing in the bomber race tonight. And Blanton is going to get the second spot away from David Russell as the white flag comes out for Ted Volpius as he makes his way down the back straightaway. And here he comes, ladies and gentlemen, coming out of turn number four to the checkered flag. Ted Volpius will win his second feature race of the year for the Mod Minis and become the division's first repeat winner of 2016.